is Ben Richter. There are three intruders in my house. Huh? What's happening? Naughty boy? There's someone in the study! We almost got him. Has he called anyone? Well, he tried. I put a program that blocks any attempts to communicate with the outside world and activates an alarm in my tablet. It's a good thing I did it, huh? You did amazing. Excuse me? What's this shit? If you hadn't put that in, the kid wouldn't have realized what was going on and we would have caught him. Before you start bragging, think about doing things <gasps> right. I am the first person who wants everything to go smoothly, okay? If we leave here empty-handed, you and the fucking nut can get on with your lives. I am a fugitive. With no money, I'll get caught, and I won't get out of prison before I'm 50. If you try to threaten me again, I'll crush your head. So this girl, she's threatened both of her accomplices since I've started this and uh, apparently she's just here for money these other two have more of a personal agenda but with her she's just here for the cash man and again lady we got the cash you don't have to do this maybe she'll be the wink link maybe she'll be the reason that we make it out she looks kind of like a, a, a dope head though I don't know. What about the sister? What's up, sis? What? Alright, so she needs her medicine. So that, I guess that's the next objective, huh? Get the sister's medicine. Man, it's raining hard, too. The sister's room's upstairs. And there are the stairs. these people building a freaking well this is the this is where they're trying to gain entrance to that's the laboratory so how about these people building a, a, a freaking safe room but the only communication in the safe room is a, a hardline phone what it's kind of ridiculous right state-of-the-art mansion I mean, it's not really a mansion, but this is a big estate with all sorts of technical uh, innovation going on here. And these people can't manage more than a hardline phone in their, their uh, safe room. So we're back upstairs again. I need to, one, watch my ass, and two, figure out where the sister's room is. All right, so I need to go all the way down the hall, hit a left, and then the sister's room will be down there. But I gotta go around to get to the door. Great. So we're gonna hit another left and then a right immediately. It's a long way to move. And 
Here comes this bitch. I don't like how you have to sit like perfectly in these boxes or else the uh, thing blacks out. I need to see out this crack. I mean, I could always, I don't know. That works, I guess. It's letting me look through it now. Looks like there's blood on the couch down there. You see that? Way off in the distance. Alright, so here she comes. Is there an alternate path? I mean, I guess I could go downstairs. But that dude's down there. If these people were smart, they would just sit in the dark for a minute. Everything is so tidy. It seems unnatural. Oh, come on, come on, come on. I have him. Now you're screwed. The bitch just kicked me in the face. So cold. I mean, it's a kid. Can't you just grab the kid? You really got to kick him in the face. Oh, how sad. It's a bunny rabbit and a bottle of pills. I'm going to write a song called Bunny Rabbit and a Bottle of Pills. Alright, so I'm going to come up these stairs. And I need to make a left. Go down the hall. Right where this douchebag is. Alright, is this it? No, it's the next room. I know you're around here, boy. I can hear you. That guy's going exactly where I need to be. They saw me. Come here. Come on. Fuck, you caught me. Kid, but you couldn't win. So that guy, he says he's sick of the violence, but still he finds the little boy who he outweighs by at least 300 pounds and gives him a nice firm backhand to the face. Quietly. Quietly. Was I in the right room to begin with? What is that? Why is it glowing? Is that just moonlight? This is my room. Right? That's my room. To go to the sister's room, I came out onto the terrace. And I walked around the side. 
gonna hide for a moment. Cause that guy's got me nervous. Sounded like he was right up my ass. Alright, it won't let me look at the map while I'm in hiding. Again, the, the rain sound effect is nice. Alright, we're gonna continue to walk around. Where's the bunny rabbit? The sad bunny, where's the bottle of pills? Irene, I'm here in your room, but I can't find your pills anywhere. They have to be around there. I left them on. Oh no! Hi, Ben! The monster's coming towards you! Gotcha! Is this what I'm looking for, Paul? So much pain for this? He's taking the pills with him! Ben, I need my medicine! <laughs> Can you take them from him? I'll try. Really? So now I gotta go try to find this dude. Take the pills from him. Right there he is. But how do I get them from him? You are not at all like I imagined you, Paul. Married and with children. You have a very happy family, don't you? I love what you've done to the house. You could put on a concert here. It's clear that you are at the top of your game. This guy's clearly unhinged. So maybe that's why it was telling me to go down there, is because I needed to follow this dude down there. The problem with being at the top is that the only way to go is down, and a long fall awaits you. See, now this guy's going precisely. You thought I hadn't seen you. Fuck. In this story, the monster is the one who wins. The monster. <laughs> the problem with being at the top is that the only way to go is down, and a long fall awaits you. stairs this time before we follow along.
I'll take everything that matters to you away. I'll do the same thing you did to me. Irene, I haven't been able to get the pills. Dude, <laughs> really? <laughs> These people must hate kids. I had a feeling I was going to have to go ask mom and dad when they show me this steel graphic here. Irene, I haven't been able to get the pills. <laughs> Get to the cellar from here. I gotta get to some stairs. thing into the right. Oh, some pizza. We just stop for some pizza. Alright. Got one upstairs. Got one across the way. Looks like we might have two upstairs. Or maybe that's the same dude, I don't know. Back downstairs we go. Now do I go right? Left. think that the sense of direction is perfect with these maps. That one's locked. I think you could close the door just a little more quietly, kid. Alright, there's where we need to go. Back up into the vent. Somehow this kid's able to climb up into the vent. I can't wait until this is finally over. Kid, you might not want it to be over. Being over might just mean that mommy and daddy are not around anymore. Ben, are you okay? Yeah. Sweetie, you could have hurt yourself. 
Were you able to get help? I tried, but they blocked the computer somehow. I couldn't do anything. Dad, Irene needs to take her pills, but that man has them. Oh. Ben, you need to get into my laboratory, just above my study. Uh, I, I'm sure there will be more pills in there for Irene. Why do you keep the pills there? Don't ask questions, Ben! <coughs> Go up the stairs next to my office. The code for the door is 4891. Get in. Take the pills and get out. Do not touch anything else. Understand? Well, why don't I just... They're heading for the cellar! Why don't we just free mom and dad and kill these assholes? Hmm. I'm going to take a look. <laughs> what do you want now? I think the time has come to explain what's going on here. The house is completely isolated. I've cut the landlines, there's no internet connection, and we have your cell phones and laptop. Mr. Richter, you have no choice but to collaborate with us. Someone will realize what is happening. You've taken a week off in your luxury vacation home. No one will be surprised if they don't hear from you during that time. How do you know all this? We also happen to know that there is a laboratory behind the door of the second floor. We have been hired to retrieve the formula that you've hidden inside there. Are these the pills? Yes, that's what you have been looking for. Take them and please leave us alone! He's lying. If these were the cure, he would never admit it. In any case, the pills wouldn't be of any use to us without the formula, not to mention the research data. Mr. Richter, you just need to give us the password to access the laboratory. We'll just take your research, and then we'll leave. Oh, we don't have any choice. Give it to him. They're lying, Jane. To use my research, it's not enough to make a copy. They have to be the only ones with the formula. And for that, they have to delete my files, and then kill me. That won't be necessary. Of course it is. The formula's in my head. I created it. I have no intention of giving it to you no matter what. I need that formula. It can't be true. Paul, honey. You more than anyone should know that there are worse things than death. We have all night to play on your strings. Sooner or later, we'll get our hands on your kids. If you're not reasonable, I'll have to make my own music with them while you watch. Could you bear that? I'll leave you to think it over. Please wait! Now... Tell me once again why the parents aren't instructing the child to free them and kill these assholes. I mean, really. So is this chick just going to hang out in here? Can I move? I don't want to move with her standing right there. I would make some noise. I guess she is messing about on her phone. And if they catch me, uh, it'll probably let me pick back up right here, so. Let's give it a shot. Alright, how do I get out of here now? I go in this vent? Or 
this one. No, apparently vents on the ceiling are the only ones I can access. Four eight nine one, is that what it said? So this is just another hiding spot. the vent that I fell through. Just climb on back up there, kid. Go ahead. Pay for this. Well, she hit me in the balls. What a bitch. 